How's it going, everybody? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today, as always. Hope you're all having a beautiful day, wherever you guys might be. So today, we are going to do something I've never done before. We are going to play Strikeout with a team of full version 2 esports colors. That's right. If you don't know what version 2 esports colors, I will show you. I only have three legends that have version 2 esports colors, so I'm, I'm limited to these three, but I will use different skins and whatnot as we play. So I have Zariel, Ember, and Thor. And these are what the version 2 esports colors look like. And I can do a full strikeout team using them. If you don't know how to get version 2 esports colors, it's super easy and it's free. All you have to do is watch Brahalla on twitch.tv slash Brahalla. Watch the esports uh, tournaments and make sure you have viewership rewards on and you get esports version 2 colors for free. That being said, these colors are pretty rare. I mean, they are easy to get, but they're also pretty rare. Like, I've never seen anybody do a full strikeout team with version 2 esports colors. So, I'm pretty sure I'm one of the first people to do this. And we're going against, uh, we'll just call him Sir. We're going against Sir. First game with all three legends, esports version 2. Feeling a little bit of lag, but not really enough to make it unplayable. I think my computer is just being a little bit laggy, but we should still be able to play fine. And we got first stock. Let's go. Man, I feel a ton of lag. I don't know if it's just my computer or what. Ooh, he wants to fight off stage. No problem. Oh, goodbye, Barrage! Woo, she wanna play off stage? I have no problem playing off stage. Gauntlets are one of the best off stage weapons in Brawlhalla. Like, it's so good. I would say gauntlets are even the best. The second best off stage is probably Sight. All right, GG. I thought he was gonna use a recovery and get back on stage, but I guess not. All right, so for the next game, let's go ahead and switch it up. I'm not gonna start at Zariel this time. We're gonna start it out as Ember. Then we're gonna go to Thor, and then Zariel. I like to switch it up every time. Well, we'll do a different Zariel, but we're gonna stick with version two esports. I don't even know if we'll get to use Zariel. You know, it just depends on if we even get to our final stock or not. All right, got our next match. And this time we're starting out as Ember. Looks like we're going against another Mirage, then Yumiko, then Koji. All right, let's see if I get a three stock with Ember. It's kind of hard to do with Ember because she has low defense. Uh, so it's easier for me to die. She came at me swinging. Oh, she gonna do a signature like that when I'm not even close. We should be able to punish. I can't even get a weapon, but yet we're still doing all right. Oh, I wanted to hit her with that down thing so bad. It feels so good if you can. Oh, baby. Oh no, she rage quit. Oh. I mean, that was a zero to death, but still. All right, that one doesn't count. Let's just let's just go into another one. All right, another Mirage. Oh my goodness! So like every single opponent is starting out with Mirage. All right, let's see how we do. Technically, I count the last match as a three stock. He quit on his first stock, but all right, man. People are really eager to uh, come punch me, even when I'm giving them a weapon. Oh man, my Ember! I'm feeling good with Ember lately, like... I feel like I could even play some rank 1v1 with Ember, maybe. And... She is gonna be toast? Yep. I don't know, though. I mean, sometimes, like, you just go against people that aren't that good, so, like, it makes you think that you're good, but then when you go play rank, you play people that are actually good, and then you realize you're not that good. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I don't know why she tried to do that, like, down sig. Dude, these guitars are shredding. Oh my. Oh, he got me there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 
Come back on stage. Look how high he got. Oh my goodness. Took him a minute to fall down. GG dude, GG. Man, there's not a lot of people playing this morning. All right, uh, let's just start it out with Thor. And <laughs> I can't get a good opponent right now. Usually when I play a strikeout, it's pretty close. Uh, <laughs> we'll finish it out with Zariel this time. Actually, I'm going to pick a different uh, Ember skin. Let's go uh, Beach Ember. Why not? Or Beach Zariel. All right, here we go. This guy's a Platinum, so definitely should be a little bit tougher of an opponent than the last couple. See how we can do versus uh, Team Esports. We're literally just obliterating everybody. All right. This map, I gotta turn the music down a little bit. It gets loud. Oh, didn't think I was started out with a SIG now, did ya? I've been uh, wanting to play Thor anyways because I'm trying to get better with Hammer. Oh, or not. Okay, okay. Like I said, better opponent. He, he right away countered me with a nice gim. We'll have to uh, bring it back here with with Ember. Not a problem. I'm better with Ember, but you know, we'll, we'll just we'll practice with Thor next match. It's all good. Just like that, we brought it back. Tied it back up. All right, here we got an Ember versus Ember showdown. Oh, oh, and just like that, we took the lead. <laughs> Oh my goodness. That may have been a zero to death. I, I wasn't really paying attention, but it may have been a zero to death on his second stock. Ooh, we are getting so much damage on Rayman. Oh my goodness. It does take quite a bit of damage with Ember to get them uh, high enough, you know, to where you can actually kill them because Ember really doesn't have a lot of kill options that are, you know, very, very good, to be honest. Oh, that was a good sig. With Katars, anyways. You pretty much got a side air or hit him with a signature. Maybe a recovery. Woo! GG, dude, GG! <laughs> that was a fun match. Even though he destroyed our Thor, so let's go ahead and start the match again with Thor. Um, this time I'm gonna. Go Ember. We'll go Ember last. I keep on like destroying everybody with Ember. Um, let's try the Arc Beam Zariel, and then we're gonna go to Ember last. This time, Ember the Hunter. Oh, that looks really good on version two esports too. All right, this time we're going against Mercury Seventy. Uh, she's playing as Azuri, Bodvar, and Thor. All right, two Sword Legends, and then Thor. And I'm starting it out with Thor, somebody that we didn't really get to play too much yet. And hopefully I'll be able to try to get that three stock, but I'm not really like trying super hard, but if it happens, it happens, you know what I mean? Let's just focus on hammer training. Oh, that's a good one. Again. If she if she gets to this level of the plat of the stage, my side stay goes out so far. You know, it, it just makes it a pretty easy hit. Thor is a really good legend if you know how to use his signatures. And you know how to use his weapons. I'm trying to get better with my hammer, and I guess it's looking a little bit better here. It just takes a lot of practice. I mean, I've practiced a lot, so I'm not terrible. It's just, you know, I'm always trying to get better. And I, I know I could get a lot better, you know. The skill ceiling in this game is ridiculously high. And I'm nowhere near the ceiling of skill. I should have just done downlight hammer versus hammer. He threw out a neutral sig, probably hoping I would jump into it, but I've played a long time, so I tend to try not to jump into sigs that are out of range from hitting me, you know? Thor versus Thor. Oh, that neutral sig. Thor sigs are fun, though. They're a little bit different than, you know, most legends, so that's why I think they're fun. Three stock. Almost.
Oh man, he's really close to, to killing our three stock dream. Oh no, we got it. Alright, GG dude. GG, well played, GG. We got another three stock. Hey, give him credit, he didn't rage quit. You know what I mean? We've been getting a lot of people rage quitting. Alright, I'm gonna start it out with Ember again because I'm just having so much fun with her. We'll go Zariel, and then... I, d I didn't even get to see the Arc Fiend Zariel, so we're gonna go that one. And then Thor, we're gonna change up his skin. Let's go Undertaker. Oh, I think this is the same guy we just fought, but I don't actually remember what his name was, so it might not be, but... Yeah, I'm really hoping uh, I can get a lot more esports version 2 colors in the next tournament. Because there's some other legends I would love to get them for. Oops. I would just like to get esports version 2 with every legend. <laughs> I got esports version 1 with every legend, but it took me a long time, probably like a year almost, so we'll see how long it takes for the version 2, hopefully not that long. I know during BCX they said they were going to drop a lot, but BCX not till the end of the year, so. I really have no problem fighting Scythe with a bow, it, it's not so difficult, in fact, the bow is probably the best Scythe counter in the game, possibly. I'm going to turn the music down just a tiny bit. Ember versus Ember, Katars versus Bow. He's coming in uh, a lot more aggressively. I like that. I always say you have a better chance to win when you're aggressive. When you're defensive, it's not so much. He is trying a lot harder this game. I mean, you don't want to be like stupid aggressive where you're just throwing out, you know, attacks willy nilly. You got to try to hit. Oh, but, oh, oh, and there it is, oh, what a nice Ember versus Ember duel, that was fun. All right, Rain Man. Oh, man, he killed the three stock dream, Rain Man, how could you do that? Alright, we got Zario, no problem. Ooh. I probably should have done a down sig. I guess I wouldn't have fallen down then. Off the bottom of the stage, but he's fine. I thought I might have been able to kill him. Oh, GG, oh man. The way the gauntlet stuns them when you do a downlight, so fun. All right, I'm gonna do one more game. Uh, this time we will start it out. I almost three stock with Ember every time. I guess we'll start it out with uh, Thor again. We didn't get to do Undertaker and then we'll go Zariel. Still don't think I, yeah, I saw Arc Fiend Zariel. All right, let's look at Secret Admirer. And then we'll go back to Ember on our final stock, if we even get to use her, but... Oh, look how good that version 2 esports looks. Alright, last game, going against the Kraken. We just Kraken puns. <laughs> what a funny clan. I think I fought this guy earlier, and he had, a, he had a really good start. But then I ended up winning anyway, so we'll see how this goes. He doesn't like to give people weapons, so we gotta be careful about that. If I remember correctly, this guy's good with the greatsword, so I gotta be very careful. Look at the speed of his combos, and I just threw my hammer away. His speed is good, but it seems like he's having a hard time facing the right direction, and then he throws his greatsword away, which is good for us. I love doing Thor's neutral sig. Oh, get him with that side sig. Dang, I figured he was going to try to do that neutral sig, but I thought maybe I could hit him with my down sig, like, as he came up, but a little bit, a little bit asking too much there. Oh, he got a little bit too crazy with that greatsword. Look how good Secret Admirer Azario looks with the esports version 2 colors. Gauntlet cam? Yes. Oh, man. Zero to death is Zul. Zul didn't even get a chance. 
Another one? Wait, wait. GG, dude. <laughs> oh, man. The gauntlet gimps. Oh, look how weird Mako's face looks right there. Okay, well, anyways. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. That's going to be it for this video. I really wanted to do a full strikeout team with version 2 esports colors. So, if you enjoyed, please drop a like. And be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. I'm going to be making more videos like this as I get more colors and more team ideas if you have ideas for teams for strikeout let me know because there's so many good uh team ideas wow that looks so good with frozen forest dang anyways guys take it easy